Welcome to Kitty Blaze Morrowind. I'm Nighty, the Black Panther Kitty, and I'll be your host for this episode. And it seems I dropped something while between episodes accidentally, but it's not on the floor, so I guess it's nothing. Okay. So let's head. head. Honestly, I need to check. It's in the south turret chamber, so it is in the south wing. So we need to head over to the south wing. South wing. Another slave. Damn it, I'm going to end slavery. Quickly. No ghost here. There it is. Since this is a magical weapon, we can use it to drive the ghost away. Also, this fight has, me, has helped us learn light armor. Okay, so one thing is the gateway haunt does not give us anything. But one thing is we have learned a little bit about this uh, from this and we can now search the room. So the chest is empty. Because there might be something hiding here in the room. There is a pillow which is owned. Hm. I actually was expecting that there was some kind of piece of paper here which is a clue for what happened. But I'm just going to have to ask around. Well, we were sent to the council chambers. Which is okay. And... Um, because we're going to go to the council hall anyway. Okay, let us now check the other side. What do we find in the north wing? Glurong Grashula. She has nothing for us to offer. Okay, nothing to offer for us. West wing? Okay. I thought it was only north and south. North, south, west. This is confusing. So each cardinal direction has its own wing. My patience is limited. Yes, ma'am. Maybe you can help me a little bit. You seem like you can offer me some mm, training in the magic skills. Wow, this is expensive. I think I should train by myself. But Dignity of it all. I am. An, I actually don't know what an indignity means. And I don't even know if she was referring to me. Origin of the Mages Guild. Oh, whatever. Whatever. Let's head back to the North Wing. I know that I did not check out everything. And let's. Head downstairs. There is another slave here. And let's head outside. And this is inside of Zedrith Mora, next to this big gate. And in order for us to remember that we've been here, I usually, when I play this game, open the stone door. So let's see if we can sell some more things to traders over here. Hurry this up, will you? Yeah, I do have some business to conduct, ma'am. So she only takes ingredients and I'm keeping the blight disease because I'm pretty sure I do have a quest around that. Journeyman, journeyman, same type. You know what? Keep the change. Thank you very much. How much does, does this person have? I don't like you. I doubt if anyone inside with Morada does. So. Go away and stop bothering me. OK. 
Okay, okay, if you don't want my orcish weapons. Let's check. So this is a pub. I'm not thinking about going to a pub now. Alcohol is not good for my concentration on the magic arts, you know? So let's take a look. Maybe, maybe this woman wants my orcish weapons. Maneki. She also doesn't like me. Why does everyone dislike me? I do have the hospitality papers, ma'am. Do I need to mention them or something? Let's see. No, I can't. Can't mention them. I mean, she's an outlander herself, isn't she? She's not an Ashlander. Just, it's kind of weird. She's just decoration, like a default decoration, decorative NPC. Same goes for him. Well, he's seems like an imperial guard or something. I'm just going around. I'm going to check if I can find the way to the council hall. So this is where we started off. This seems like someone who basically buys and sells about anything. But they have very, very low disposition towards me, which means they are going to give me very, very bad prices. Okay, let's see. I need to get into this building over here. So I'm going to check if I can. If I can not take on the world. This is not Day of the Tentacle. If I can head towards the right at some point. Yes, this is where we need to go. This is the road to the entrance of the council building because I do want to talk to the councilwoman and also talk about becoming a member of House Telvani because I want to be a mage, a good one. The Telnaga Great Hall. So let's see if I can ask someone for... Uh, I can't actually ask for that woman. Either for the house. Or about the house, that I'm is. Waiting. There is House Telvani. We live comfortably now. Mm, enchanted clothing. So let's try upstairs. In quarters? I don't think uh, this is where I want to be. Mm -hmm. Okay, then don't talk to me. I did not want to go into the quarters. I guess I need to get more deeper underground. Oh, that's an exit. Okay. This looks like it is some kind of dungeon thing. So there was only this door to the general quarters. There is nothing in here. Oh, there is something. Yeah, of course, there is. 
this. Then I can get upstairs to here. You'll get more than you bargained for from me. Of course, they're unhappy that, like, a strange person that they never seen suddenly barges into their quarters. I would like some foreigner to just enter my bedroom. Ah, this is Telnaga, which is the Counselor Mage Lord Master Niloth's wizard wizard tower. Ah, and I'm actually not allowed to enter the city. This is why everyone hates me. I'm not allowed to enter the city unless I am a Talvani, which I want to become, honestly. So, so this is not the council house. This is the wizard tower. I want to talk to the council house. Let's see. This is the gateway in alchemist house. Monk, sorcerer. Morak Tongild, no. sorcerer here let's ask him if he knows something or she I'm, I'm always unsure with the names Ortiso is that a woman's or a man's name it's a woman's name she doesn't like me but do you know something about the gateway no <laughs> this is not something I would tell the likes of you so basically as long as nobody likes me here I'm not going to get anything from anyone. Which does make some kind of sense, honestly. Okay, let's head over. is here is this just a way out of out of the town or is there something here I'm sorry because this is an island so this is a Daedric Shrine, okay. It's weird, my memory must be utterly broken because I'm pretty sure that the Telvani Council House is also here. And that I can go there and ask to become a member of House Telvani. Like I can with every house, but I don't seem to see where it is. Well, let's first head to Edwina and give her what she asked us to fetch. Flights of stairs. It is a nice area here. Especially if the sun rises. Ok, 
Okay, through the Imperial Shrine into Vrin Hall. And now I need to just remember if it was downstairs or upstairs. One of the two is the Fighter's Guild. And of course, right the wrong way. Right the wrong way. Weird way of saying it. The Mage's Guild is above the Imperial Shrine. And go to Inial for travel services and to head over to Aldrun. And there she was. Real quick. There she is. Uh, the winner, Albert. Did you find any plans or blueprints in Mansulevd? Yeah, I found these these blueprints that you asked me. Well, have you found any Dwemer plans yet? Yeah. Yes, this is exactly what I was looking for. Excellent work, Conjurer. Um, speaking of work, do you have any more duties for me? Mm, I've heard that the miners in the Gnesis Egg Mine have broken to the ruins of Bethamas. Say, the ruins of Bethamas? Officially, the Gnesis Egg Mine was closed because of blight, but I heard the miners broke into the lost Dwemer ruins of Bethamas. I've also heard that they found Dwemer plants similar to the blueprints you brought me before. Go to the Gnesis Egg Mine and bring back any plants or blueprints you find. Share your thoughts, friend. I enjoy the company. So, first of all, a little note. Gnesis Egg Mine. Dwemer Ruin. Bring any plans to Edwina. Just so it doesn't get lost. Because, of course, for now we are first going to sell our stuff. Thanks, Edwina. I'm going to do this. But first, I'm going to sell the stuff that I found. The stuff that we took from the Orcish Brutes. We are going to go to Balmora. And first of all, since we just arrived here, uh, hello, Miss. I, yeah, I'm going to find a healer, Messalini. But first, ah, Jira, it's so good warm to see you. To you a warm day to you also, Jira. Uh, it's always nice to see you. Let us see if we can, if I have something that I can give you. Well, it seems like. I'm sorry, I only can offer you this, this soul gem, and you don't want soul gems. Well, I'm going to, to speak to our mutual friend, Ravir, uh, about, about the stuff that I have. But before that, I'm going to check Do you have if you have anything to make Restore Fatigue Potions out of. And Restore Magicka, for that matter. Restore Fatigue. Du, 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 du. More restore fatigue. Quama eggs. There we go, and one calcinator because we don't have one yet which increases should if i'm not mistaken it should increase the quality grade of our potions and because she likes me so much of course she's going to give me even a discount Maybe I should train one point of alchemy here. Thank you very much. And since I can't move, I'm going to do this now. And just burn through all the ingredients that I have. And now Cell, no, no training. Sell the last three ingredients back to her. 
And now we're going to check kill card disease. Just we do we don't need all of those. I think I need to sell the calcinator again because it weighs 25 uh, points. Well, I still made some money just by making the potions and trained some alchemy in the way. Thank you very much for the help. So let's let us see. You're the spellmaker, aren't you? Open. Ninety points spell chance. On touch. There we go. Ninety. Where is it on the English keyboard? There is the button that was looking. Now it's gone again. There we go. Nighties. Knock, knock. There we go. Now we have a spell that opens 100 points, not just 50. Which should help us open the two things that we have on our notepad. Sorry. And I also want to see. Training is so expensive. I always also want to see if I can have a constant fortification effect My attention is with you. on a ring or something. Or something that I'm wearing. Something like fortify. Or restore and shining. There we go. Is this even possible? Mm. Duration. This is. Mm, duration is bad. No. It's not what I want. I want a constant. I guess constant effects don't exist or just exist with some even soul trap shock damage shield recall okay this is obvious this is obvious hmm. ah there it is type of cast for the enchantment. Okay, I need to need to look at that one up to enchantments that last. I do want to have a fortification of strength and magicka, basically. Let's head back outside. And see our good friend, the trader Ravir. That's weird. When I tested out the new graphics card, I did not have frames below 10. I think, I, I now suspect that it's actually me recording. So, which means I should get another computer for recording. I already do know that your Daedric weapons are fake, friend. And he already is a pretty good friend of mine with 600 gold to spare. And even those are too much for him. Okay, let me check if he sells me the stuff. Oh, I 
I'm sorry, I need to spend multiple days of doing this anyway, because I need to buy things off of him just to get him into the price range. Oh, this is expensive. What did I just buy? Wow, value 9,000. Basically, I want to push him slightly below 600 and then try to get him to give me all his gold, which he does. And now I'm waiting one day. And if I remember correctly, and which I do, he will have all his money back again. So I'm going to sell the next Orcish Battle Axe for, I'm, I'm okay with just getting 600, to be honest. that I'm losing money that way but um, if he only has 600 I'm going to have to barter for a few days and I'm going to get a few 600s out of him anyhow at least three plus whatever I bought off of him to make the price go down are expensive. Oh yeah, of course, they're dwarvish. Okay, let's try and squeeze a little money out of him. Because he likes us so much, and he likes us even more because we successfully um, traded. And since my mercantile skill increased, it also means that he will now give me, he should now offer me more money initially for things. And take less. So this is due to the skill and due to me, um, him liking me more. So I don't want the Kitean War Axe, and I don't want these or that or even that Dwemer blade. Okay, let's try getting him to sell me that, which works, and he likes me even more. We are becoming very good friends, which is obvious because we are both Kajiti, so we should like each other from the get-go. Dire Flame Arrow. Let's remove some things from that list until we are at 550. Okay, only one, about 100. Something like that. Up that to 600. And wait until he has restocked his money. Okay. Restore fatigue, restore fatigue. So these these don't weigh much, so I'm going to keep these for now. Honestly. Let's check that I only have each key once. Because these basically this is this is money which is more expensive, kinda. Okay, let me see. Do you have any bows that are better than the ones that I currently have? No. So I'm going to sell this to you for a little bit more. 
So now I'm going to check if I can actually find... Let me see about my... So I don't have any... Okay, so my unarmored is better than light armor. Is it? Oh, yes. Yeah. And archery marksman, there it is. Ah, throwing knife and bows are the same. So this is also a marksman. So the, the game does not distinguish between um, throwing and archery weapons. This is an armor. Maybe I can get some other light armor. I want to actually go to light, the light armor thing. Does not actually look like it. What I'm looking for is, I think, glass is the strongest light armor I'm looking for. Well, there is even more traders over here, an outfitter. I'm actually looking for the weaponsmith that I want to, or the Fletcher. Be best. The Homebroker. Well, he might have weapons. She might have weapons. 1 to 10, same weapon. So let's check out, as a last thing, I think the weapon swift was on the other end of the town. Somewhere around here. Or even behind there. Let's check them out and then... Mm -hmm. Should be, there's the alchemist. Oh, that's fine clothing. The temple. There we go, there's the smith. That's the one I was looking for. I should get downstairs over here. The razor hole. That does not look like a weaponsmith. Oh. Uh, hmm. Come on then. Say something or move on. One to twenty for a longbow. Of course that one is better, so I'm going to exchange those. And then you can repair everything that I have, including the longbow you just sold me. And let me then rebind my inventory item to the longbow. Thank you. And since it's raining, I'm going to stay here while doing the ending moderation. So I hope this was not too boring for you. We are going to <clears throat> check. Now that we have uh, completed the quest for it, now we are now going to check again if we can um, become member of the House of Talwani. And then we are going to head to the Gnesis Egg Mine for which we just have to travel to Cool, where we've already been before. So that's the itinerary for the future. <laughs> I'm kind of kind of um, hypnotized by the game screen right now so I'm going to close my eyes. I hit itinerary for the future and we are going to see each other or you are going to see me basically yeah when the dice decide so I'll roll the dice now and you will have to wait until the next episode bye bye